Yeah, um, so my name's uh, Kevin Nangama. I uh, play for the West Tigers. Um, obviously a Fijian background. Uh, I started playing footy at a young age, uh, six. Um, pretty much played because my all my friends were playing at the time and also my older brother. So I sort of looked up to him at, at, at that. I was still doing now. Um, and then pretty much played all my junior footy at uh, the St George Dragons till I was 18. Then I moved up to Newcastle. Um, played my played two years of 20s there and then um, progressed on to first grade. So I spent four years in uh, the NRL at Newcastle. Um, then from there moved to Penrith. I spent a year there. And then um, from there I moved to West Tigers. So I've been there for two years and next year will be my uh, third year there at the club. Um, it's real good. Um, obviously I was real excited to come here. I've never been here before. Uh, it's a beautiful country. Um, so many similarities to Fiji. Uh, in the ways of like tropical and, and culture as well. Um, definitely enjoying it so far. Um, it's only been two days, but you know, we went to the waterfall on Sunday. Um, we're going to another one on, on Thursday on our day off, so also looking forward to that. But I'm um, just enjoying the week with all the boys. Um, it's always a fun week in camp with the Fijian boys. And also, I've got two players that, two of my mates that play for the Samoa team. We play together at West Tigers, so um, they're over here, so hopefully, try and catch up with them during the week as well. I think, I think it's important for both of us. It, it, at the end of the day, it's a friendly match. You know, like you get nothing out of it. But I think there's a lot of pride, uh, passion um, for, for both teams. You know, the Samoan boys, they're, they're playing for their families, which is what we're doing for as well, representing our culture, um, our ancestors, you know, the generations before us and for the generations to come. So um, in regards to that, it's massive. Uh, it's always an honour and a privilege for myself to represent my country and my family. Um, so it means, um, it means a lot to me. Um, I think there would be more advantage, I guess, to the Samoans, you know, this being their, their home ground and also their home country. Um, I heard this is like the first time they're having a test match here for Rugby League, so in that regard, it's a, it's a, real, big, a real big occasion. But um, in saying that, um, we're not, we don't really feel too much pressure. Um, as Fijians, we're pretty laid back and, um, you know, we're just enjoying each other's company, enjoying the week, because we don't know, this might be the last time we play for this same group of boys. So, um, yeah, just enjoying the week, taking it all in and... Um, yeah, you know, looking forward to um, Saturday. It's definitely going to be. Um, I'm excited to play. Um, I'm sure. I'm sure the Samoan boys are as well. And um, it'll be definitely a tough physical game. But um, you know, this is why we play the game. You know, we love we love the game of rugby league. And I think both sides will be happy to represent um, their their heritage. How's the preparation been so far? It's been good. Um, this is our third day here, but we've only had our second training session today. Um, but um, yeah, I'm surprised with how how um, good the boys got the cause going. Um, you know, the, the, we've been the first time we're playing together and it's all new co uh, cause, new coaching staff. Um, everyone got the, um, the lingo pretty good and all the, all the cause down. So um, um, in that regard, it's only been two sessions, so it's still pretty early, but um, so far, so good. To be honest, like the captaincy is for sure, it's a shared role. Um, I think they take a lot of pressure off myself. Um, we've hit to the boys, um, the older boys, um, just, you know, like helping out and, you know, say, having their own say. So. They're, you know, in that regard, it takes a lot of responsibility off myself. But um, I'm not, I haven't really said too much to the boys. Just enjoy the week. Um, you know, like I think ball control is a massive thing for us. Just um, you know, trying to control the ball and possession and, and tackling. Um, you know, the some warm boys they got real big boys. So I think defense is going to be a big thing for us um, this week when we come against them. It's awesome. You know, like at the end of the day, we all play rugby league, so um, we're celebrating that. Um, I'm, it's good that some all got a, a presence of rugby league here. I know that Union's got a heavy presence here, so um, it's the same in regards to Fiji. You know, Union's got a, a heavy presence, especially with them winning gold. So it makes all the younger kids want to play <laughs> rugby union. So in that regard, that's that's part of the reason why I play for Fiji, um, just for the um, the future generations, just to, to show them that you know there is a pathway in rugby league as well. Um, it's not just Union, and um, you know, just happy for some more. You know, like. 30 years, that's a long time for Rugby League, so, you know, big, congratula big congratulations to them because uh, Rugby League in Fiji has probably only been around for about um, five years, like they've had actual proper comps, so, you know, it's a, it's a big um, occasion for them and, uh, and it's real good. Still got a, still a fair bit away from the game, so not thinking about it too much, but, um, yeah, come game day, I'm real excited to play against some of my ex-teammates and, and the Samoan team. Um, I'm sure there'll be a big crowd out there. Uh, probably be a bit one-sided, but you know, at the end of the day, we, we all represent the Pacific Islands, so um, you know, we're all out there to to have fun and and enjoy the game. But um, yeah, just definitely looking forward to it. It should be exciting.